man. What's happening now? Craziness. Oh, it is. It is indeed. <laughs> oh, the demon of Erlu. Yeah, this is the uh, the dude that uh, Ramses was dealing with before. Well, that's unfortunate. What she did? What she up to? God, she just laughs at everything. Never know who's on what side. She's talking with Groff earlier. Ramses is confused. This game is definitely full of topsy turvy, uh, turvy stuff. Which I think is awesome, by the way. Keeps you guessing. Are you strong? I don't know, man. Bart, you're a tough son of a bitch, but can you defeat the guy that single-handedly killed, like, 50,000 soldiers by himself on his, on his feet? I have my doubts. I really do. Well, I guess the Yggs Brazil is kind of... <laughs> oh, wow. Look at that thing. It's got like... It's got like fairy wings, though. That's kind of... Kind of crazy. Yeah, who the hell are you, dude? Oh. This guy. Mmm. Oh, yeah, that's, uh... That thing is cool as shit. That's Ramses' gear. <laughs> that is crazy. Wow. I mean, especially with the sword, too. But you don't really get to, like, see that gear really in action until later. Posing! Now, this is where you get really, like, uh, Machina anime thing, anime nonsense going on. It's good stuff. Woo! Do to do to do 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 to do do to do to do to do to do do do. Now we're gonna we're gonna do we're gonna go to war with uh the red gear, the thing that might destroy the universe. Ah yes, old foe. Oh no, the red gear is pretty freaking scary. Oh oh, that's brutal. Just two seconds into the fight, he loses his arm. Ugh. Poor Ramses. Oh, body slam into the sand. This is pretty cool. Damn you. Oh, finished off. Over and out. Well, <laughs> now Bart's like, uh, never mind. I'm not messing with that. I'm not messing with that. That is just too much for me. <sighs> Let's pull out. <laughs> that just sounds so wrong. Oh, I'm sure. I I'm sure she said that many times. No, you're armless. Oh gosh. <laughs> I'm sorry, my mind is totally in the gutter today. It's craziness. Mm hmm. Well, Bart, you got your hands full. Are you going to be able to take on the scary, crazy red gear? It's going to be insane. Insane in the membrane, man. Gonna be some crazy shit. Oh yeah. <sighs> Woo! All right. So this uh... <laughs> parts like this really friggin' sucks. I do not like this. All right. Well, let's try to let's try to fight the uh, mysterious red gear and see how well it goes for us. Just a hint, not well. Um, let's uh, let's use some wild smile. See if that blinds him a little bit. Cool, his accuracy's down. That's nice. Um, all right, let's go get him in the face. 
Okay, we're doing some damage. Bart, I believe, in you. Alright, the Beat Serpent. Now we're gonna get to see some of the uh, the gear moves that we've developed using Death Blow. So there's Beat Serpent, that's pretty good. Uh, but now this is when we're gonna die. Yeah. There's no way to beat this dude. <laughs> he just absolutely annihilates you. Look at that, 20,000 damage almost. And you're dead. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. It's bad stuff. Really bad stuff. <laughs> They're just like, uh, shit. We better turn around. This is not gonna go well for us. Who is Jer Jericho? Is he like the... Oh, he must be the first mate. Okay. The Bernoulli effect? Oh, right, yeah. Yeah, it's, I guess the Bernoulli effect. I don't know if it's a real thing or not, but it allows, like, large objects like the Yggdrasil to float on air for a short period of time. Full power! Yeah. By the way, guys, if there's, um... If there's moments of silence in this video, I apologize for that. I had to... I'm gonna end up having to splice three videos of footage together just because the microphone decided to stop working. Like, just randomly. I think it was just because I didn't plug it in enough. Yeah! Now we're just like revving it up like a friggin' motorcycle popping a wheelie or whatever. <laughs> yeah. Got the power of the warship. We're gonna try to just like ram the friggin' red gear with with this giant sand cruiser. I mean, I guess that could work. I guess that could work. But I'm not entirely sure. <laughs> Exclamation point, just like, what? <laughs> what is happening? Uh, well, I guess we did squish it. It's a good thing we didn't squish Bart in the process. So I guess maybe it'll be okay. I mean, that's one way to do it. If you can't beat him with a with a regular gear, you might as well uh, employ the the magical mystical power of um, hitting it with <laughs> hitting it with something else. They seem to be okay. I just got I just got twenty thousand damage worth of repairs to do right now. Uh, what? Did. Uh. Did we not kill him? Is he just that friggin' crazy? Uh, what's. <laughs> what's happening? <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Jesus Christ, he's holding that thing up? That is crazy. He's using his magical, mystical fairy powers to just, like, lift up an entire friggin' warship? Well, jeez. I mean, I knew that, uh, the Yggdrasil was gonna be facing some serious damage from that torpedo, but this is gonna hurt. This is really gonna hurt. Is he gonna throw it at Bart? That would be insane. Oy vey. <laughs> it would really suck to be on that ship right now. <laughs> oh god. It's like, well, that uh, that tickled a little bit. I'll admit. But uh, you're, you're gonna have to... Have to try harder. <laughs> Dropping a warship? Uh-oh. This is not good. Shit. Oh god. Oh god, oh god. Move. Move out of the way, Bart. It is slowly coming upon you. <laughs> if you see a giant ship about to hit you over the head and squish you to death. Uh, yeah, nothing's working because we're in the middle of the air. Oh god. We're so fucked. Ugh. Yikes. Oh man. I 
Jesus. <laughs> oh. Yeah, it's, I think at this point, as much as we love the Yggdrasil, I think it's gone. I think we'll cease to function as a ship. And you might want to think about saving your own lives. But hey, they're, I love their uh, use of traction. Oh, yeah, we gotta get out of here. <laughs> I can't leave you, even though I might have been the one that's responsible for this whole thing by passing on information to Ramses. <laughs> yeah, if you're not working with him. Oy vey. That's a good thing. And Maison's just so, like... I don't know, Ma Maison is, like, this under underrated badass. Because he just, like... He keeps calm, he... Oh, here we go, we got a cutscene of an escape pod. Look at that. Whee! It was 1985 uh, full motion videos, man. So, yeah, like... Maison is just this, like, he keeps us cool in every situation. He helped us escape from the damn castle. Like, I, I, I think that, I don't think the game has given him his proper due. But we'll see more of him later, which is always fun. Ah, uh, well, that was a shitty situation. <sighs> What's going to happen next? Is Bart going to be okay? No. Oh. Is he, uh... Oh, shit. Oh, is this where Faye is? Is Faye doing okay, or did he just totally go ape on Vandercom? I guess he totally went ape on Vandercom. Wow, look at that. Look at that. Vandercom was brought back to life just to just to fail again, huh? Crazy. <laughs> uh wow. He uh now we're gonna we're seeing the quotations again. Huh. All right. Well, uh, we've reached an interesting point of the game. Obviously, uh, we don't know where Faye is. There was, was a mysterious red gear that we've seen in the past in the memory catacombs of Ramses that has basically destroyed the Yggdrasil. Is the Yggdrasil going to survive? Where's Faye? What's going on next? We're in a state of total confusion. Find out in the next episode of Let's Play Xenogears. Thank you for watching. This has been the Benjinator, and I'll see you guys next time.